I wonder about your self-critic and when it comes up the most. And mm -hmm. when you watch your performance, do, do you? I didn't watch it. I haven't watched it to this day. You haven't. Uh -uh. You know, it's a good show. <laughs> That's what I've you been told. <laughs> are, you, yeah. are you serious that yeah. you're not laying in bed at night going, I'm just going to, it's been a couple of years now, I could no. watch it? No. Mm -hmm. Is that because you are protecting yourself or because you know, or you have, uh, the memory of it is so wonderful that I you don't I can tell wanna... you exactly what it is. Okay, well, go ahead. I am such uh I will notice every single thing that I did wrong. Marsha was left-handed. I'm right-handed. I will notice every time I pick the cup up with my right hand instead of my left. I will notice um, moments where I'm like, why did they pick that take? I remember there was another one. Like, I will tear it down, and I don't want to, to tear down the thing that for me was the most special, extraordinary artistic experience of my life, coupled with being the thing that I was the most sort of celebrated for, that I don't want to then, like, start mailing back uh, statues because um, I've decided it's shit. Is that true? Yes, I don't wanna, I don't wanna go, oh my God, how embarrassing. I didn't deserve any of that and this is, no. It'd be so, so I thought what would, it, what would happen if you did something you've never done before and you just chose to believe what people are saying and that the thing is good and that you are good and that at the end of the day, what this meant to you was so special that you're gonna keep it clean. You're gonna keep it safe for yourself and not tear this one down. And it's something I've never done before. And it was just a way of knowing myself well enough to know that I was gonna blow it up in a way that would be so unkind to something that was so beautiful. And um, I'm not yet at the place where I can regulate my uh, decimate, you know, my, my finger on the button tendencies. So I thought the only way to do it is to protect myself. So I'm being a good friend to myself by saying, let this be what it is. It's so pure and beautiful and was unlike anything you've ever experienced in your life and has brought so much opportunity and excitement to your working life. Just let that thing live in that place. And to, to me, at the end of the day, whether I, if I had never, if the, if I hadn't won any of those things and the show had not won all those things, it, it still would have been what it was for me. Right. So it has nothing to do with that outcome, although that was delicious cake. It was incredible cake. I ate every bite of it. I loved it enormously. But it still was what it was for me if nobody watched it. It's yours. It was mine. And I just felt very protective of it. Maybe when I'm an old lady, I'll watch it. Hey folks, thanks for watching. If you like what you just saw, then why not subscribe? Click right here for lots more off camera. And if you wanna see the hour long version of these conversations, I'm gonna give you the secret link. Here it is, offcamera.com. Check it out. <laughs>